Hey everybody, welcome back to the Infinite Regression. Oh, so infinite. It just goes on and on forever. But I'm not going to go on and on forever before spinning this wheel and figuring out what we're playing next in the Steam Budget Stravaganza. Oh. <laughs> Horde of Plenty. All right. Uh, I believe that is a twin sticky type one. We'll, we'll be back in just a second when it's ready to roll. Okay, Horde of Plenty is ready to go. And I've got my controller because I believe this is twin stick shooty shoot shoot. Uh, yes, okay. Oh, it's got like high scores. High scores near me. Wow. Everybody near me doesn't even... D doesn't even play it. Mode. Beginner, easy, normal, hard, wicked. Um, let's try normal mode. Because I feel like it's going to... Okay. All right. All right. This is really smooth so far. Oh, oh. Get that live. Oh, no. Oh. Took a hit there. Uh, skeleton. They're a little harder to kill. Oh, come on, Skelly. Okay, they come out running at you from behind. That just feels all kinds of unfair. Now I've got to occupy the middle of the screen. Oh, 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 oh. Oh no! Oh! I did not realize that was the end of the level. Okay. Oh, sweet. Okay, I gotta conserve because... Oh, this guy's gonna wreck me hard. Got him, though. Oh, coin. All right. More money, more not problems, because I want that money. Give me them ducats. Okay, I'm coming in here getting that money. Oh, spiders. I do not like spiders. In life or in games, I think they're a terrible video game trope. But of course, this isn't an RPG, so... Like, I would love to play an RPG where at no point do I have to face off against giant spiders. It has never happened in my entire life. Oh god, I got wrecked by a spider. Oh. Th oh. Okay, come on. We gotta get this guy first. Okay. That releases the spider goons. I'm like leaving all the fun stuff over here. Ah. Ah, come on, get off of me. You guys are the worst. Uh, 
Okay. Here we go. There's the end of the level. I'm going to take it because... Oh, sweet potion. Okay, come on, come on. Ah. Man, I am not doing well. Not doing well at all. Okay, come on. Oh, jeez, there it is. End of the level. Oh, that one was rough. Okay, what? Okay. Oh, it was like some very close quarters combat here. Oh, and they, they got me good. <laughs> like, really interesting level design, I have to say for a game in this price range. I mean, come on. Like, I've seen much worse than this. In this price range? You kidding me? Okay. Ah. Uh. Okay. So, yeah, I, I'm not... N not the best in my area, not the worst. Okay, setting. Music, burst, player shots, effects, brightness, resolution. Okay. What's the story? Oh, there's a story. I don't honestly care that much. Okay. Um, le let's play it again real quick. And let's go uh, wicked mode just to see <laughs> how bad I die and how quickly. Oh, yeah. These guys are much harder to kill. Uh... Well, I'm not completely dead yet, so, like... Like, I, I expected to die basically immediately, so... Not dying immediately is a, uh... Solid... Solid job by me. Yay me. I just got achievements. Die, skeletons. Oh, come on. Come on, here we go. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Oh, if I don't pick up the end of the level there, do I just keep going forever? I mean, not forever, but, you know, for a while longer. Oh, it just kind of turns into the... Oh, God. Oh, no. S stay away from me, boulders. I'm not about you. Uh, spiders. You're worse than boulders. Yeah, these tank things are much harder 
much, much harder on the harder level. Oh, oh, crap. Get these hearts. Keep myself alive. Yeah, you gotta do a lot of circle strafing in this game. That's just... Facts about the world. Okay, this one I'm taking. Oh, get out of there. Get out of there. Okay. Yeah, I kinda like that you get to decide Oh, the dude with the bazooka is way worse. Uh, like he shoots way more and he's just more of a jerk. Ah. Uh. Ooh, I got an extra life. Look at me. Like I honestly didn't think I'd make it past the first level in wicked mode, but I'm like not half terrible like oh <laughs> shouldn't have said anything oh crap he coming at me they're all coming at me yeah I got trapped there anyway get in get out oh man like so much worse. Oh my god. See, this is what I expected to happen to me first level. Another extra life, sweet. I can use that for like not dying and stuff. Can I ever use these coins for upgrades or anything? Or are they just points? So I would love it if there was like a whole upgrade system. Okay, come on. Oh jeez, you guys. Oh, this is... Yeah, it turns frantic in a hurry. Oh, God. Okay. Here we go. Get serious. Oh, he's gonna murder me. <laughs> I couldn't get out. Yeah, I'm gonna die. That is bad. Okay, well, yep, 12 through 16, all right, sweet. Anyway, uh, cool, twin stick shooter uh, with uh, nice leaderboards and it's very frantic action, cool stuff, Horde of Plenty. Uh, give me a second and uh, I will put a review on it. Okay, so, Horde of Plenty. Here's what it's got going for it. It is uh, super fun, <laughs> very frantic gameplay, 
Um, very good level design, interesting level design for that type of game. Some things I'd never seen before. Uh, those shifting walls, for example. Um, you know, how it does those little side areas where you can, you know, at your own risk, pick up power-ups and stuff. Because, you know, you pick up those power-ups, there's also going to be a lot of enemies that rush out when you stop through there. So, you know, uh, you, you've got to be strategic, but you've also got to be quick. And, you know, the, the fast, frantic uh, sort of gameplay, it's fun. It's a good time. It's what you want in a twin stick shooter. And so, um, yeah, remember that I am gauging these based on how much I paid for them and, you know, kind of what I expect out of a budget game. Um, you know, note that, like, if I were to stack these games up against the big boys, they might not fare as well. But sometimes you'd be surprised. And this one, I think, is really solid you know, for even a much higher price point. Actually, just out of curiosity, how much does it cost normally? Because I got it for 49 cents. Five bucks normally. That is not a bad price point for how smooth, for how fast, for how crazy this game gets. Um, yeah, not bad at all. Anyway, here's my final score. Uh, final score for Horde of Plenty, five out of five. Fruity ass summertime cocktails. That's how I feel. Just enjoyed it. There was nothing that I would really want to see done to it to make it better. Because sometimes when you're buying in the bargain bin, it's like, oh, well, what's wrong with this game? That is, you know, you get a lot of games that are almost but not quite there. This one is 100% there. It's there. It's ready for you to pick it up. 49 cents right now. That's a good deal. Anyway, ladies and gents, that is it for this one. I will see you in the next one. Okay, bye.